everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's video, I'm just going to discuss a few different things to look out for if you're wondering if your RAM or random access memory is failing and how to check for faulty memory. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward tutorial, guys, and let's go ahead and jump into it. So we will be running a tool a little bit later in the video, but I just want to kind of go over a few different symptoms of what faulty memory would be like. So if you notice that your computer seems to be randomly restarting very often, has very slow or weird loading patterns perhaps, and also if the computer is displaying the incorrect amount of RAM, so maybe one of the RAM sticks is bad if you have more than one. So one way to check for that is if you open up the start menu and selected the setting icon the left side here, just went ahead and selected that and then select system. And then you went to the bottom of the left side here and selected about. And then on the right side here, it says installed RAM. If it's not detecting some RAM on your computer, it probably won't be showing up here. So that's definitely a telltale sign that there is an issue. So it's definitely a sign that you have an issue. So just keep that in mind. Just a few different things to look out for. And we're going to go ahead and actually check our memory to see how it's holding up. And we're going to do that by opening up the start menu. Type in Windows Memory Diagnostic. should be an app here. Go ahead and left click on that to open it up. I'm going to go ahead and select Restart Now and check for problems. Make sure you've closed out of any open programs, of course. So select that option.
Alright guys, so we're back in the system. Hopefully that was a pretty straightforward process. And as always, thanks for watching, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.